welcome back. First off, let me say I am so sorry that I did not get a video up yesterday on Wednesday. Um, if you have looked at national news at all today, um, you know that there were a lot of tornadoes in Oklahoma last night, and I live in Oklahoma, and we were um, really fairly close to the storms, but we are north of where the worst of them are, so um, me and my family, we are all okay. We don't have any kind of damage um, or anything like that, but um, it was kind of a little bit of a close call, and uh, the way that things kind of go in Oklahoma when there are big storms is we all stay glued to the news, and when the tornado sirens go off, we all go outside and look. <laughs> so, um, it's, it was our first uh, tornado of the spring, so I just did not get around to filming a video, and I apologize, so here is the video I was going to do yesterday, which is Wantables Makeup Box for March. I haven't gotten the makeup box for a little while. Um, I was getting it for a while and I absolutely loved it. And then I got a few boxes in a row that I just wasn't really excited about. And so I stopped getting it for a while and switched over to BoxyCharm, which I absolutely love. And you can see those unboxings on my channel as well. But Wantable has changed um, the way that they're doing things a little bit. So I thought I would give it another try. Uh, so here's how it works now. The subscription box is $40 um, instead of $36 if you're a subscriber. And then you get a breakdown of prices of how much each item costs you. So you can send back the entire box, you can send back part of the box, or you can keep everything. If you keep everything, then you get a $4 credit towards your next month. Um, and then otherwise you just pay the price that they list instead of the full price for the items that you decide to keep. So. I am excited to see what is in my box this month. Um, so here is the little thing, and you, you take a fairly lengthy quiz, and I will tell you what I have on my sheet. Um, under Loves, I have eyeshadow, cool, eyeliner, lash products, blush, lip color, and nail polish. Under Likes, I have complexion products and tools. And under Dislikes, I have Brows, Warm, Highlighter, and Bronzer. Not because I dislike those things, but I was trying to adjust my box a little bit so that I might get some things that I would really like. I have plenty of um, highlighters and bronzers uh, and brow products right now. So I will add those back in um, under Loves after this box. I was just kind of trying to tailor this one a little bit, which is one thing I do like about the quiz. You can go and you can retake it as many times as you want and kind of tailor your box to see what you're going to get. So the first thing that I see is by Lashem, um, extensions in a bottle, fiber lash extensions. It says, fab fake lashes are great, but here's an alternative. Just a few strokes of this fiber lash extension mascara looks just like extensions in a bottle. So I am excited to try that. Uh, I do wear fake lashes from time to time, but I find that they are kind of a pain in the butt to put on, even when I have like a really just easy time putting them on. And so most days I just wear mascara. So it looks like this is kind of a dual ended thing. So I am excited to try that. Retail is $30 and my price would be $15.69. <clears throat> Next thing I see is by Kativa, and I have had one of their eyeliners before that I got in a subscription box that was a blue felt tip liner. I am actually really surprised that I can remember that, and I liked it, but it actually dried out on me fairly quickly. So this says uh, it's a precision eyeliner, paraben-free, waterproof, and let's see, gosh, that box was a little bit difficult to open. So it looks like this, and it looks like it is um, one of your just kind of standard roll-up liners like that. So I am excited to try that. I'm still looking for my Holy Grail Tightline uh, product, so I will be glad to try that. And of course it is in black. So definitely excited about that. Let's see, retail is $20, my price $10.46. The next thing I see is by Bodyography. And this is a nail lacquer in the color Fancy Free. And um, it looks like a really nice, pretty pink color. 
Um, it looks like it's three free. Uh, retail value eight dollars and fifty cents. My price four dollars and forty four cents. So, um, you know, I will uh, swatch this and get a picture up on Instagram. I am Dishwater Dreams on Instagram. So look for that coming soon. And then there is one more product in here. Lip Thick Super Plumping Gel by Sorme. It's really kind of a neat package there. Um, get full sexy starlet lips without injection. Apply over bare lips with AM and PM or on top of lip liner for an added gloss. Retail $18. My price $9.41. So I'm excited to try that out. Um, I do have very thin lips and um, I... I haven't ever really tried a lip plumper that I felt like I actually saw any kind of results from. I have tried ones that, you know, kind of did the, the sting, the, the bee sting type feel on your lips. So I will let you know um, what that feels like after I give it a try. Total value of the collection is $76.50. So pretty good box. I'm excited about everything that I got. And of course you will see these products either in empties and fails videos or in favorites or stash videos as I use them and try them out. So you will get to see reviews of all of these products as I use them. And as always, I will have a blog post that has a little bit more information um, and pictures of everything that was in the box. So I'm excited about this Wantable box. I am really liking their new price structure. Um, I did get their accessories box already this month, and that video is already up if you want to check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching today. And for everyone who checked up on me on social media last night to see if my family and I were safe or checked up on me today, thank you so much. I really appreciate all the well wishes and concern that you sent our way and this time we're fine and we'll just keep praying that we'll be fine every time. <laughs> it's one of the hazards of living in Oklahoma. We live in a state that the sky tries to kill us for three months out of the year. Uh, so anyway, thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.